surprising how I can still be alive. Sub pattern. Yeah, I realize I can't. I cannot do. Um, I can't do back to back short streams. But with the with the massive workload I have for videos and YouTube, I can't do that. And still need to sleep a reasonable amount. I'm trying, but not possible. I've been distraught. My second favorite Discord was deleted randomly by the owner. It was all fine for a year. I was already dull died too. No. I th I'm still I'm still having it in the works. I will have dimes log into my Discord. If I'm to perish, he will log into my Discord and tell you that I've died. I'm still working on having that be a thing. Sup, Likely Lana? Yeah, I said all boards yesterday since chat wanted it and I'm just a dancing clown to satisfy strangers on the internet, so yeah, we're doing all boards. You can't do it with that attitude? What do you mean? You give dimes all the blackmail to release upon your death. I don't have any blackmail, no. I've lived a, I've lived a clean life. I tend for my reputation on Twitch and YouTube to be clean until I retire. i be very clean and pristine. Mario had five stars in my mystery land yesterday. Oh, damn. Is it delayed? I'm using, um... Yeah, why is it delayed? Let me see here. Oh wait, no, it's it's not delayed because I have good internet. It's just not showing the new messages. Yeah, there it is. Even though I just fixed the alignment before I started stream, yeah, it wasn't showing all of it. Yeah, I'm a professional. I am, because it wasn't actually broken, it was just misaligned. Also, Chad, I want to show you some some stuff before I start stream today. I um, added some new emotes. I was working on the Daldemed alphabet emotes last night and today, and that's why I was a bit late, so let me show you. I only have, I have, I have a little bit less than half. It's the 1990s overlay fault. It's not 1990s. You're just old. Hey, let me show you. I have only a little bit of the alphabet set through, but let me show you. So we have A for Alda. We have B for Balda. We have C or Calda. And of course we have D for Dalda. We have E for Yalda. I don't know how to really pronounce this. But you, you get the you get the flow of the of the thing. I mean Dime's already an emote. He's he's four different emotes. And then we have F for Falda. Might I was thinking of like Fat Dalda for this one, so that's why I used the fat image that Rem made. And then we have Halda, me with the nice head of hair. We have E Alda for. This is a really old Photoshop. Like, like the the photo this is based off was like at least two and a half years ago. No, this isn't Frankfurt, this is Seven Television. Seven Television. It's a third party extension that's a bit more flexible than Frankfurter or BTTV Television. And then lastly, we have Nalda. Now, this is an actual old photo. I This was like way back, I think, in my college days. I, I'm just, you see, like, I'm just like a nun. So that's why it's called Nalda. 
Yeah, but I'm working on getting some other emotes. You did not make... Oh, yeah, you did. Yeah, I'm working on getting some other ones in. And also, I got this one, too. I, I meant to have this as an emote a long time ago, but just procrastinated. This one is confirmed. Since people have contention of me saying retard in 2023, and if I so choose to, you know, mellow out my edginess, I'll just say you're confirmed. Retard, lol. <laughs> yeah, those are all the new emotes. Um. Oh wait, why doesn't it show on here, damn it? I gotta fix this one as well. Wait, does it not show third party ones on here? I, mean, I can never get something just to work the way I want it to. Goddamn it, but if if you have the extension you can see it, I guess I'll just have to fix this later on. Probably not world record, but at least a PB. Mm. I guess uh Do I show you I have something else I want to show you, but I think I might want to save it for later. Thank you for the one bit face stuffer. Now I'll save it for later when other stuff comes in. Alright, let's do runs baby. Oh no, I just, the bots load, I just have the preview set up. Oh yeah, it's not connected, didn't connect to OBS. Uh, fuck world record, go for the universe record. I mean, given how this game has only been made on Earth, Earth's world record is the universe world record. Alright, now it's working, try submitting it again, face over. It wasn't connecting to OBS. Oh yeah, I forgot. Yeah, most likely so. Okay, it's still not showing, why not? Splits BG, that's the command. Dow gonna get the WR on Kepler 452B2. Dow gonna get world record on Kepler 452B? Fuck those alien scumbags. Yeah, they can't run like me. Okay, so I'm already having problems in the stream. Has even started yet? <sighs> okay, why isn't this working? How did I miss perfection? All I did was add emotes. I've not messed with this since last night. Oh, wait a minute. Okay, I think I found it. Okay, I, yeah, I think I found it. Missed some, I uh, changed some scenes around.
I don't, man. This is... I toggled off the visibility of all my audio settings. This is just amazing. Okay. Alright, yeah. Now we're back. Stream took a while to get back, but it's all here now. Also, let me make a note to fix... Thank Christ, I type fast. I probably don't type as fast as like, the average person, but to me, I've definitely improved typing. Yeah, I'm going back to using whole food splits since it's been a while since I've been on all boards and I have a new layout for timing. So if I do better on a board in all boards and it's like an individual board uh, PB, I have, a, I have an accurate timing of the individual board PB. Because Abe got a new space line world record yesterday apparently, but his timing was off by at least 9 seconds. I messaged him about it. So I'm essentially doing a wholesale sort of strategy. Since I'm doing all the boards, there could be... I'm not doing a run right now, I'm just changing the settings as I usually do. So, so on, on the app, since I'm playing all the boards, if by one chance I do better on a board than my current PB, I can submit that as the PB and or world record. It's a lot better than just doing all the boards individually. Alright, let's do this. I think my Japanese card is broken or damaged because it, all, the, all, all those times my screen flickered and turned to the rainbow screen, it may have been because of the cartridge. I whittled down the problem either to my console or my cartridge. Maybe. I'll run American, and then if if need to, I'll switch to Japanese. <clears throat> I'm recording, right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, maybe only closer because the f the few dialogue boxes somewhat help to move text faster. All right, three, two, one. Starting, baby. So, if anything, the f this first one will, of course, be a PB. I'm just placing a time down. Whatever it is will just be a benchmark for me to compare future runs to. Now, I didn't drink any five hour, I just had breakfast. Woke up, had breakfast, worked on the emotes, worked on the VODs, and then went live. No artificial stimulants required. That's a sign of weakness. Even though I do have two 5-hour energies on my desk right now, I don't drink them. It's just there as an option. Okay, hope you had a good luck fap. I don't fap. I just pray. to your BBC and it comes very stoic. I get to develop that ability. But when I do, I'll let you know. Although that, that would help with the time investment of masturbation. If you can just simply pray to come the moment you finish praying. Like, imagine... Like, imagine all the time you would save. All the things you can get done.
Did you end up getting a date on that Japanese game? No, I didn't. I foolishly confessed to her because of Chad's advice of saying let's get married. Fucked it up to begin- fucked it up a little bit. Um... Had something going again, and out of pure frustration and... The world, and all, those, and all the other CPUs trying to screw up my chances, I tried doing it again, and then failed again. So I just stopped in frustration. It's like, can't get a girlfriend in the video game, can't get a girlfriend in real life. Sometimes you just need to know when to quit. That quiet bitch wasn't wife material. I mean, maybe she didn't have like any kind of stuck up, prudish, that she behaved like the other women did. But it just happened. Why Austrian? For some reason you triggered Google Assistant to look up singles in my area. <laughs> cool. I have that sort of effect on... Uh, robots. Hot, lonely singles in your area. Wanting to fuck. Yeah, I'm a robot influencer. Austrian gained 12 stone in 6 months after moving to America. That's definitely not my type of woman. But, interesting. I mean, I guess at some point you can blame America's... ...obesity culture, but at another point you have to blame yourself. The food may be there, but it's your choice to eat it. Free online dating, chat, and fun. BBW from Austria. If you believe that size really does matter, well, rest assured that there are plenty of, uh, there are plenty of BBW Austrian members for you to choose from. Thank you for this link pattern, I... That was great. Temptation is hard though. Yeah, that's why I have to fight against it. Bitch! Not you, Lon, I wasn't calling you a bitch, I... Prematurely split. Yeah, but you just have to fight against it. It's tempting. Your success not only means profits for Dialdemate Incorporated, but also a well-deserved bonus for your efforts. Remember, it's not just about hitting those speed milestones. It's about fleshing out any distractions too, both in your runs and the office facility. I do flush it. I don't know why you're perpetuating this lie and slander that. Uh, my toilets are left unflushed. I do flush them. Kuna dude is clicking on the link as we speak. He probably is. Yeah, Temptation is a hard battle, but it must be fought. It's not me, it's the boss. Yeah, that's me. The boss of Daldemet Incorporated would naturally be Daldemet. Which is me. The shareholders are technically the boss. No, there's investors. They know the risk. It's actually MNQ44. Yeah, he's a secret chairman. Board member. Finish! 
Yep, he's almost... He, he wanted that 51% equity, but uh, I said no. It's my company. Also, thanks for that bit face off earlier. I didn't say that earlier. I guess I'm becoming a already a big streamer. I'm ignoring donations. Dimes is the CEO secret lover. He's not. Business partner, yes. Farming on Pokemon Crystal right now. I don't remember which platform that's on since I lost track. <laughs> I lost track of the Pokemon games. The Dollar Maid Incorporated but happy farming. eagerly anticipate another fiscal triumph as they witness the company's strategic moves unfold. With bated breath, they anticipate the outcome of Dollar Maid's upcoming speedrun. Hopeful for both virtual victories and substantial. You most definitely get a return on your investment. Thank you for the one bit face upper. Yeah, dividends will be paid out at least by an increase of 12%. Don't worry. Oh, Game Boy Color? I thought that would have been like a DS one. Because I've never heard of eggs being farmed on Pokemon games. I like Pokemon Blue. It had Blastoise on it. Blastoise is my favorite Pokemon. Although, if you had to swallow the load of one of your viewers to keep your Twitch channel, what viewers come would you swallow? Face stuffers. Answer the question. Stop. I literally can't think of any other viewer who is just remotely, you know, normal, so like besides face stuffers, so it was just the first thing that came to mind. They suffer the sexy ass fuck. True. I'm just riding my bike up and down, hoping an Ella Kid or Pichu hatches. Well, I hope it does. Still not the pen turn. Used to spend my junior high lunches doing Pokemon dupe glitches with my friends on a Game Boy Color. Interesting. Oh, I just reminded myself, chat. Another person has reposted my TikTok onto Reddit. A different subreddit. Ah! Uh, I didn't buy a star because Reddit was on my mind. That's how you know Reddit is a curse. But yeah, someone reposted the, the TikTok again to Reddit. I think Pattern showed it to me on the Discord. I think I've always guessed you're around a little bit late 30s. Best year of my life was 2006 and 2007. Well, nice as long as you had a good year there. There's an embarrassing TikTok of you floating around on Reddit. Yeah, the the 24 hour apple juice mug, whatever, however you want to call it thing, he got reposted again to, to Reddit on the r slash horny jail or something subreddit. It's on the Discord, you can see it there. And it was captioned as, people should be more like this guy, which was kind of nice of him. That was you, you reposted it? Yeah, I did see some... <laughs> I 
Uh, that can't keep off your thingy, yeah. Wait, so, so you reposted the video that TikTok onto Reddit. Yeah, r slash horny jail. Wait, Pattern, so your Reddit name is you slash dream is taken xd. That's your name on Reddit. Oh, dude, I'm talking. No, you don't. Repost means you take the original media and put it onto a new site. You didn't repost it. You just shared it on Discord. Motherfucker, learn your English. I don't mean to be a grammar Nazi, but. God damn it, dude. I seriously doubt your Reddit name would have Dream is Taken XD on it. Yeah, but repost. I'm not. I'm not arguing semantics. Yeah, someone uh, uploaded again. I just can't seem to escape this video. What if it was? It probably was pattern, but just on a different Reddit account. Also, what do I have? Oh, the the OP of that. Post reply to my comment. I commented on the on the thing. Oh, this was posted two years ago. The fuck? I thought this was new. Oh, okay. I'm I'm an idiot. I thought okay, yeah, this it was posted onto Reddit two years ago. I didn't see that. It's my breeding BBW account. Okay. That was just Jesse didn't get the updates. Initially I was because there was a, the first time it was reposted got I think 50,000 upvotes. Those should have been mine, but now I'm kind of over it. Hopefully your BBW account is successful. Thanks for good luck, Blanca. Bring back the mug? I mean, that was a mug at someone else's house. So I can't really go there just to get the mug. It wasn't an electric Pokemon. Damn it. Shoot. That's why I stopped playing Pokemon. It's okay, I have Pirate Land to watch. As long as you have something. Hmm. I wonder how many different subreddits this has been posted to. A mug tier list? Sure, why not? Although I've considered for future Daldemet merch, making a mug. Because I want merch that has utility to it, not just, you know, clothes or something. Full of apple juice. What is Donkey Kong doing? I'm way too used to splitting after every turn that I keep lifting my foot. It's instinct now. You 
down, deep down, it was a large mug of a dude's cum. It was not. It was actually just apple juice, since it tastes good. Talking to a Tesla employee on Discord, he seems like he has very low morale. Being foul. By working at the company's uh, stressful. It's a big name brand, very popular. Yeah, the dude's name was Apple and he had his juice. I like how you found some way to twist and, con and contort that into another ejaculatory joke. That's a good one. Good one. Elon thinks his employees should sleep at work. I've done that before, but it's not that good. I'd rather sleep in my own bed. Like I only I'm only working at work and being around those people as I'm working. If I'm not working, I don't know you people. That's my philosophy at my workplace. As soon as my shift ends, I don't know who any of you are. Even on the clock, I'll just pretend to know who you are. I'm convinced you would hire slaves if it wasn't a publicity risk. I mean, slaves are cheap labor. I don't know, maybe it would. Maybe it's just that... eccentric. Oh, no. If that's even the right word. He probably asked his handler about hiring slaves once. <laughs> his handler gave him a spreadsheet showing the revenue saving he'd get having slave labor. Not just slave, but midget slaves. Since they cost less on insurance. And then, you know what? He gets some midget slaves, paints them orange, and you guys have some Oompa Loompas. <laughs> Blame Lincoln for getting rid of cheap labor. Yep. I feel like Daldo's family owns slaves. <laughs> no comment. Yeah. I guess I'm doing that. Line in the 1700s and 1800s, a lot of black families, black families in Texas who were higher ups owned black slaves, injured them badly. LOL. I did a report on it in high school. I mean, yeah, no, I, I do know about that. Blacks owning black slaves. But I, don't, I truly don't know if they did have slaves.
Yeah, it's called that show. <laughs> yeah, Rem knows what's up. He's a realist. Bunch of lazy people don't want to work. Don't want to put in the time. Long winded escapade to finding an editor. Yep, just can't find one. Huh? Everyone wants to become a Daldament. What do you mean by that? What does that, mean? What does that mean? Is that a good thing? Oh yeah, by the way chat, thank you for reminding me of Blanco. If any of you have any recommendations for... Daldemet faces or things for the... Daldemet alphabet emote set, just send them to me. Because I'm still missing half the alphabet. Can't explain what's in clear prints. Of course. Trying to hide and obfuscate. Very nice. Face suffer. If, if that was you meaning have Ape Dune's face in the emote set, I'm not doing that. Ape Dune has his own emotes. This is definitely the this turn. Yes, not really that good. How much does Ape, Ape pay for rent? If you're implying he lives rent free in my head, he does not. That joke is really old. Yep. Well, that coming a mile away. To ape, so I can post his emotes in rage. You mentioned that before, and I said it doesn't. I don't know why you keep going on about that. who's run free in... who Ape Dune has run free in his Gert's head. Check that out. I forgot I'm a Ape Dune sub. Oh yeah, this man is so in my mind. He's, yeah. He can never leave my brain. I even sub to him. To type Zemos to make sure he really stays in there.
I'm starting to try to force the mini games into different, just different choices. If I see an obviously bad mini game, I'll just like mash A to pick something else. Pattern doesn't want you to leave his head. I didn't know I was even in pattern said. But if he doesn't want me to leave, then sure thing. Someone posts their hot water tank to r slash plumbing. Everyone plays, you're gonna die, re. Maybe because he is going to die. Was it like a bad hot water tank setup? Kind of like a PC setup, that's just not good. I should have put on chapstick. A little bit, but you would think it's a nuke to about to blow. Okay, then I guess he's gonna die. Oh, from the replies, they imply that. I'm sure the people on Reddit are knowledgeable in their field. I need some chapstick. Oh no, it's on my desk. I thought <laughs> I thought it was in my bathroom. I always have it on my desk for convenience. Yeah, non-standard pipe. Non-standard pipe up attached to it. Okay, I guess, yeah. Yeah, I thought, I thought it was in my bathroom, but now it's just on my desk. Who needs college when you have Reddit? Yeah. Also, a lot of college uh, courses and classes are taught online. Or they have online instruction, so... You can just do that instead. I'm not gonna throw. At least not intentionally. I think for the one bit face stuff. I still have the Austrian BBW website on my browser. Why? Hello for the first time ever. Hello, Alex SR. Hope you're having a great day today. Oh, it's Axel. Looks more like Axel. Sorry. Having a great day today. I don't know how to drink water while I have chapstick on. I get chapstick residue in the water and I start drinking my chapstick. I'm good, thanks. Wild how this game got a water record last night. Yep. At least there were two of them. Um, by Bowserland world record and then Ape Duden's uh, Space Line world record. I guess a good waterfall. I definitely had a childhood, I just forgot about the waterfall method. Given how I haven't been a child in a long time. I'm what they call a... adult. C 
See, there you go. Childhood proven. Actually, he said he fixed his time. I want that mofo to have accurate timing. That's different. Oh, that's a one, yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, I forgot to share that too. Yeah, chat, check this out. So Abe didn't place the new world record for Spaceland yesterday. And he already posted the run. In the comment section. It's not showing. Uh, why is it not showing? But a hard T? What do you mean T? Did I say a word and enunciate the T really hard? Is that what you mean? I can just do this. There we go. Yeah, he placed a new time for Spaceland. And then in the comment section, I replied. This image that I made. Oh, you're just being rude to ape? Okay. But beforehand, in the caption, I said, I hate you, ape, but here's this photo for you. And then it's this gif I made like a couple days ago. He's an enemy of the state around here. <laughs> I guess so, he is. Oh yeah, I, I uploaded that dancing gif yesterday as I was going through footage. And it's about time I showcase my dancing skills to my community. Because I keep saying I, I have good dancing skills, and I need proof of it. Also, it did help that the song I was dancing to was essentially a song that helped drive energy into your hips. Whenever the song was playing, I just felt the need to start like undulating and swinging back and forth my hips, like I'm Elvis Presley. In terms of part-time, this is not really good. But again, this is just a place, a time placer run. You just want to place the time down, and then we have a benchmark. This D4 seems louder than usual. I guess I was playing on the Wii, on the game last time. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. 
Last week I completed my first run of Mario Party 4, so now I have times to compare it with. Nice. It's always good to have a benchmark. Stop. I considered switching to Mario Party 4 sometime in the near future. It also seems like a good Mario Party game, like almost as good as 2. I mean, it's a gold split because I don't have any golds. I deleted my splits and my golds. So every split will be gold during this run. Yeah, these are whole food splits now, fresh and organic. Whenever I go away from a category for a long time, and I'm not as good as I used to be, I just get new splits from Whole Foods. Do the last two turns. I especially change them when I'm using a new timing format. Good. Do you want to see my runs? Do you want to see my? You want to see my runs? No. Do you want to see okay, my runs? Here's okay, here's the link, anyways. <laughs> yeah, I've learned about. In case you get that type of thing. Thank you for the one bit run. From our part two is N64 optional or one of the many other consoles Nintendo? Oh, re-released. Um. It's most likely not. I just play on N64 because I'm a purist. It's probably faster on Wii U or... What's the other one? Switch? But, yeah, I'm just a... I'm a traditionalist, so I just play on the console it was released on initially. That's just part of my professional edge. If you're a casual or a scrub, then you can play on a re-release. But don't take that as an insult. It's just, you know, playful banter.
Emulators are made for who, Dalda? Say it nice and loud into the mic. They're made for scrubs and casuals. I know that was clear because I have a gain on my microphone. Plus a noise gate. So there's no background audio to interfere with my message. I'm listening while playing SM64 on emulator for two years. My message still stands. You can use an emulator if you want to, either through convenience or pricing. But the message... still stands. And that should be the last turn, I think. Yep. Two stars, had the highest coin. That should put me two, three. Yeah, three. I know I did because I was in the field of not having enough to afford an N64. And it was my first adventure into speedrunning, so I was a scrub. By all technical meaning. Careful pattern. Do not ask the next question you think you're gonna uh, type. So that's Mr. Force set up for runs cost more. Yeah. No, I never pretended. Yeah. When I played on emulator, it was clearly obvious. Always at the top of my splits, it shows the console or platform I'm playing on. When it was emulator, it was emulator. When it was N64, it was N64. I actually timed out pattern as soon as Axel came to stream Rem. I don't think any of you saw that. I'm not sure if you see ban messages or timeout messages. When Axel came to stream, I immediately timed out pattern for 10 minutes. Because I knew he was going to do that. You used to tell me you preferred emulator because it ran faster. <laughs> I think at certain points, yeah, but then the the emulator would crash. Or not crash, it would slow down on that one coin minigame. So it got really annoying. Also on certain leaderboards, emulator runs are hidden by default. Because it's not you're not technically playing on a console. You're just playing on a copycat machine, which is why emulators are built for casuals. So I wanted my runs to actually be shown, like on the main category, so I f finally got an N64. That's just bait face stuff, I don't take it. He's learned that his... Whatever the fuck he calls it. It's getting tiring from my perspective, so he's baiting with nice questions and will drop the retardation. Okay, I'm not an idiot. Yeah, sure, say no right now. I'm glad it does help. They don't always return, you don't know that. It's just fuel for your fun. Not the majority of them. They can just creep down and leave. 
and you hurting my business pattern is not something I'll take lightly. Oh yeah, how's your wife doing, Pattern? Mentioned her leg. Got busted up, is she alright? She's in a cast and crutches. Oh, damn. A broken leg and an ankle. Also, it was confirmed broken. You have a possible ETA on when um, she can take the cast off? Because I know bones take a super long time to heal. She's home and I'm running between my businesses and home to take care of her. Okay, yeah, you, yeah I bet you got, basically got to do everything yourself now. Probably six to eight weeks before an air cast. Oh, that's nice. That seems sooner than what I thought. I thought it'd be more like months. How's a virtual dating life going? It's not going anywhere. I don't have a virtual dating life. And the one that happened yesterday didn't go anywhere. Thanks for asking. I stopped playing that game on stream last night. Rarely do I play games uh, offline. Uh, sometimes I do, but mostly just Game Boy stuff. Actually, you know what? Okay, I thought of a new solution. Make a Tinder? Uh, I don't want to go with Tinder. I've seen the people on Tinder on, on other people's uh, profiles. It just seems like a cesspit of degenerates and criminals. Nothing but crazies on there, so... I'm not signing up for Tinder. For the memes? I'd be willing just to make a profile and then... Like, have the screenshots of, oh look! Dollar made a profile on Tinder. It's a silly little thing. But I'm not seeking out companionship on Tinder. Like, I have, I have self-respect, I have standards, man. <laughs> Advertise your Twitch channel on there. And say something like, um... If you like what you see, you can see a lot more at twitch.tv forward slash doldemet. I'd be willing to kind of do that. Just say you're an entrepreneur. I guess I could. Also, I thought of a new thing I can do. Whenever a new viewer joins, and Pattern asks, you know, the question, I'll ask that viewer, do they want Pattern timed out or banned? For creeping them out. That's what I'll do. So no longer with the preemptiveness, I'll allow Pattern to engage in the nonsense. 
And then I'll just, just let that new viewer decide. That seems more fitting. Or sub to your OnlyFans for $3.99 a month. I don't have an OnlyFans. Yeah. But it's gonna sound even weirder if, if they just join the stream, yes. Okay, what's your name and do I- I mean, that's what, what's your name? What's your age and do I have consent? So, I'll just... I'll just follow that new policy. That way everyone's happy, you know? I'm all about making people happy. Yeah. I'm happy when you're happy. Me too. I'm happy when Face Duffer is happy. And just like my stream title says, happiness today is maximum. So much happiness. Mm -hmm. Quite so. <laughs> I keep forgetting about that man. I'm way too stuck in my in my patterns and tradition. I'm glad you like it, Rem. I guess I could just save the video as a draft and then and then release it as when like publish it when it's actually done. Okay, because Rem, you're not entitled to sneak peeks at new videos. You may be VIP, but those are not VIP privileges. stop that I did but then again you can't teach your old dog new tricks so always I always leave videos as unlisted but they're still saved in the playlist in a, in a YouTube playlist you can watch unlisted videos but now I made a note of it and now I know to stop doing that you are beneath me well, that's not true also speaking of which chat Videos may be less frequent, given the massive workload I do have for VODs and YouTube videos, and I'm doing all this by myself. The VODs will- not the VODs, the YouTube highlights will be less frequent, but be more specific in the moments. I'll focus on having more unique moments and highlights instead of just eight minutes of, you know, pattern questions. And like, just stupid questions, but less frequent highlights, but more special moments just to decrease the workload on me and have some more breathing room all right for any of you who do watch the youtube highlights i checked a couple of times and didn't see them must have been bad timing yeah he's just rem is fantastic with the computer Also, I checked again on the VODs when I released one. My, the VOD of the N64 games tier list has like, only has three likes and I think like eight dislikes. <laughs> Fucking wusses, man. And I titled the VOD, Objectively Correct N64 Game Tier List. So I guess I've made him even more mad. People in the comments were all talking about, oh, which game, you know, has which legacy and 
the features and should be put in other tier or what other tier. It's like, shut up. And I think also my controller tier list has a similar thing. Way more dislikes than likes. Fuck. I read Yoshi's line. Finish! Ah, that's a bit early. Oh, it's just a bit too early. You do know people love to prove other people wrong? Yeah. I've come to realize that now, given those videos. Take a look at the mug video, yeah. And even on the Reddit repost, there are comments saying, um, mug of apple juice drinks from a, or, uh, drink a glass of apple juice drinks from a mug. Yeah, come to realize people like that more. Disproving or negativity is more popular on the internet. And when you title a video, objectively correct that just irks them more or like it fuels them more to prove you wrong and see where they think you made a mistake which clearly i didn't because that video is objectively true so clearly they can't read it doesn't help you have this professional persona what do you, what do you mean persona it's a lifestyle. It's an identity. Ah, but none, none of them know that. People who watch the VODs only get them recommended. They have no idea who I am. They see the video, see what they want, type a comment, and then leave forever. Only you people know about that. I mean, e even that's so, they don't know that. The people, the vast majority, <laughs> the only people who saw that were plebs. Were the plebs. They just saw it, ha they went ha ha, liked it, left. Only you people know about the professional identity. Although I thank you for making, making it seem like I'm more known outside. to prove the smart ass wrong. <laughs> Thankfully, I don't think I've developed a smart ass persona. Maybe... Maybe the mug video came off that way, or... The VOD, maybe. Who knows? Del just needs a spoonful of mayo to make his day. I can... not conceive of eating just a spoonful of mayonnaise. Ever since that hot dog incident in Paris, I cannot do mayonnaise by itself. No offense, that's alright. If they just interpret it as me being a smartass, I can't really do anything about that. What about a spoonful of sour cream? No, it's the same thing. It just tastes different. I don't even like sour cream. 
Sour cream is just mayonnaise, but exotic. Someone was so desperate to copy the mayonnaise, like, popularity, and like, take from it, they invented sour cream. I don't even eat ranch. What even is ranch? Who eats ranch? Okay, that's a place where animals live. Why is it- why is it a dressing? Fisher sour creams before mayo. It was made by a time traveler. A time traveler made it, okay? That's why. What dressing do you put in a salad? Who eats salad? What are you, a rabbit? Who the fuck eats salad? <laughs> Good one. Good one, face stuffer. Green, the all green dream team was a lie. No, it's not a lie. It's just the all green dream team minus ranch. Do people even outside of America eat ranch? You are a false prophet. I was never a prophet. I'm the other P word. a pack of ranch on myself at all times. Why? I've never known anyone to eat ranch. Maybe I'm just hanging with a different crowd of people. I was going to say a pedo, but then I'm just stealing Gert's punchline. I mean, you can if if he's not here to make the punchline, you can take it and then claim it as your your own. That's how jokes work. At least in this chat. Never know when you're gonna get a requested to toss a salad prison style. So you just have some handy dandy ranch. I mean, if just don't plan on going to prison then. And I doubt you'll have prison style sex outside of prison. I mean, I guess depending on who you hang around with. It should be the 11th turn. It's still not Jesus Christ. You don't know me. You don't know me. Sure, I don't, so... You could be in prison right now, typing in chat, MNQ. Could be living with your cellmates, maybe free from jail, in a home you live together. Still having prison-style sex? What do I know? Breezy's not banned, he's just... focusing on college work, or... Doing something else with his life. Smuggled a laptop in my prison pocket. <laughs> that is an impressive feat. He ain't doing nothing wrong. She lied about her age. <laughs> oh, that is a strong implication, man. That's very impressive, I'm in Q. That's a booty hole for the uncultured folk here. I mean, even even I know what a prison wallet is, and I've never been to prison. As to how you insert a laptop into there, the world may never know. Okay, well. Thank <laughs> you. 
Oh, nice, a two for three. Pounder find me on Instagram. I think, yeah, I think someone mentioned something else about finding other someone else on Instagram. Finish. Cool. Did you guys friend each other? Are you now pen pals? Is the concept of a pen pal even a thing anymore? Pattern has a private account, so cringe. Pattern, why is your Instagram account privated? What oh so private details and photos do you need to keep private? Oh, he accepted, alright. I don't know. So you don't know why your account's even privated? I don't even have anything. So it's just private for no reason. You just want to feel special and to your own. That's probably why you don't have any followers on Instagram. Besides Face Duffer. He has zero posts on his <laughs> account. Okay, nice. He just wants to make it. He just wants to make it make it seem exclusive, like like only a few slides can follow this legendary account. Yeah, it's his like alternate account, the burner, the throwaway account. I expect at least one pick. I mean, my Instagram is the same thing. I only have it just because I want to have the name Daldomet. And in case I want to, I don't know, connect with anyone on there, so. I just have the Instagram, but no pictures. needs to get back on Instagram. I do have an Instagram. I just deleted it, deleted it a long time ago because I didn't want it. But now I got it back because I just want to have it and have the name. Although the chances of someone stealing the name Dolomit was very unlikely. I don't like to run the numbers like that. So yeah, I do have one. I just don't have any pictures on there. Can you say Bustin... Can you say bustin' bustin' bussies five times fast? <sighs> For you, M and Q, no. I'm just kidding. It has your real name even? Well yeah, of course I put my real name. It's me. Bustin' bussy bussies, bustin' bussy bussies, bustin' bustin'. I fucked it up already on the second, second half. Finish. Saying. I uh, know I cannot say that five times fast. I intentionally speak slower because I need to stop flubbing my words. But I did my best. I make you hope that was uh, worthwhile. Shit, now Pattern knows my name. Well, face it for I figured out your name last night when you donated it to me via PayPal. I got an email from PayPal saying the transfer was complete and right there was your real name. And I'll be honest, face stuffer, I didn't expect that to be your real name. It's quite literally the last thing I would imagine. She struggle on my juggalo. Nice. 
Good effort. As long as you think so, I'm in queue. Yeah. But you do have a nice name, Face Tougher. It's just unexpected. Hope it showed you my credit card number two. <laughs> no, I'm pretty sure it didn't. Oh, DK, that's amazing. Jumped on DK as he died. And he took me to the grave with him. I'm pretty sure PayPal doesn't show credit card numbers. Let me check. See, even if you send a strump from PayPal. Okay, nice. It shows the receipt ID, the transaction ID. Tip to Daldamit is the product name. Oh, that's real nice, Mario. Real nice. Yeah, no credit card information. Nothing uh, personal. It's all good face up for you see my sexy beard. I'm not imagine you having a beard pattern. The faces I imagine my viewers having. I didn't imagine Pattern having a beard. Like the mental image of his face. It was named before all the cycles with the same first name. <laughs> nice. I've never not had a beard. I never knew that. It's just that I have like a, just an automatic mental picture of what people look like. And I did not have a beard. <laughs> I'm born with a beard. It's pretty cool. Typical blue collar worker. They have beards. Kippa Mario jacked my shit and then bought a star, so... Need to fix that. Based off first all, a pic of my wife also. Nice. Oh yeah, you, you can be tagged on Instagram. If you appear in, in someone else's photo on their account, you can tag them. And say, oh, this is him. This is his account. You can't see the tags? Are you not on mobile, or... You have tag disabled. I want to smoke weed with Face Duffer. I mean, you can do that. It is physically possible. I just see the handsome and autistic tags. <laughs> I mean, it is possible to be both. Weed is better than meth. I mean, yeah, sure. It's definitely less damaging to the body. It's probably cheaper. Non-addictive. So yeah, in a lot of ways, weed is better than meth. I'll get a new passport just to make that happen. Nice. All the weed. Handsome and autistic, didn't know you know CD-ROM. Nice. You are shitting me, right? Okay. Babe, I'm going to smoke weed with an internet person in America. <laughs> Meth sounds cooler. I mean, as a name, probably, but as a drug, it's definitely not. Never tried both, but even I know the pros and cons. Yeah, you can just do your research. Everyone's wrong, wrong 
cocaine is the best drug, or the coolest drug. It's definitely more popular, like in media. Like drug lords and celebrities always do cocaine. Cocaine only smells good. <laughs> Cocaine has the best songs? You mean like cocaine has inspired artists to make songs that are really good? Or is there like a band called Cocaine and they have songs? Outer systems and untraceable. If you're, if, I mean if you're doing frequent drug tests, then sure that's helpful. Just stop doing drugs and you'll pass the drug test. The cocaine theme song. I don't know what that is. It's pretty crazy that drug cartels have up their own submarine fleets. That is kind of impressive and crazy, yeah. I mean, as security gets harsher and harsher and protection around the border increases, they need to adapt. What do you mean, no fun? Like, because you're not doing cocaine? I need to get a new f fresh romp card because I'm tired of this minigame. It's a huge time sink. I need to make sure I don't unlock this minigame. I'm, I'm willing to go that far just to get a new fresh cart that doesn't have this minigame. It, like, it takes up just as so much time as, um... Or even look, around the same time as Honeycomb Havoc. It's bad. Most of the cocaine comes from the submarines? Okay. Yeah, unless you're the one on the bridge, you can just kill yourself and then finish it really fast. I did lean once or twice when younger. How is lean? I know it's popular in like the SoundCloud. What's it called? Like SoundCloud rap trap scene? Did you enjoy your lean? I think lean is like Codeine, Sprite, and Jolly Ranchers. From Mario's bitch ass. It was very sugary and thick. Just like a milkshake, baby. Of course they sell codeine in Canada. Whole population is drugged up. Letting an idiot run their country. A racist idiot. Sits at the start screen of Mario Party 2 laughing for 12 hours. That is probably what I would do, but can't say for sure. Zelda, what drug would you do if the world was ending the next day? LSD. 
Thank you, MNQ. Probably just LSD. But I was still only like micro dose. I don't want to trip too bad. I heard some positive stories come out of LSD. I mean, imagine so, the kind of things you see there. You see some pretty strange stuff. LSD is cool as fuck. Good to know. I'm definitely not doing LSD and cocaine. The world may be ending, but I am still up here in Holy Temple for the Lord. You've done LSD and cocaine before? Nice. The dinosaurs put me in charge of the universe last time I did LSD. <laughs> nice. Sounds like, yeah, that's a very positive, cool story to come out of LSD. Rem, proven right. LSD and cocaine is a power move. You trip for a while, sniff it, and pulls you out of the trip. Then you roll back into it. It's like a roller coaster. Yeah, I'm good on having a roller coaster. I don't even like roller coasters. I'll just take the LSD. Por favor. I would like one LSD, please. Por favor. Cocaine always takes over. It's always the dominant drug. If you're drunk and do coke, it basically sobers you up for a little bit. Also, that's why people always drink when they take uh, cocaine. That's why they do it. In Connecticut, we have Hippie Festival. You mean like Woodstock? Hippie festival and someone convinced me to go. I did LSD when I walked in, started drinking, and I ate some shrooms while on LSD and then a few lines of coke to wake me up. This was like 2009. I mean, that sounds a lot like Woodstock. Cool. Sounds like you had a fun time. <laughs> he was 10 years old at the time. Nineteen. Okay, that's slightly better. Do cocaine and eat cigarettes on stream. It sounds like a lovely idea, MQ, but I'll have to unfortunately reject that idea. Thank you, though. Keep coming with these great ideas, chat. I love them. Always love the chat feedback. Just want to see you succeed. Thank you, man. It's great having such a loving, supporting community. <sighs> Do speed balls on stream. What are speed balls? Oh, meaning, meaning like speed as in the street name of a drug and then have it in ball form. So you can say, oh, Dalda put balls in his mouth. I don't know what hot rails are. If it's a drug, then no, I'm not doing it. Again, thank you, chat, for the lovely stream ideas. Very great. It's a gnarly way to do meth. Nice. Yeah, I don't think I'll be doing that on stream. Or ever in real life. 
Well, thank you. I don't need to, I don't need I don't need to be knowledgeable about speedball's pattern. I'm happy not knowing more about that. But thank you. Oh, this should be another easy one. To do it on a whim. I don't do things on whims. Just do it for your first kick string. I mean if I did I'd be, you know, matching the tradition and behavior of kick streamers. But I'm not since I'm a professional. Should be another easy win. I think by two stars, maybe? Not about one star. What if me and Face Surfer join you and do it with you on stream? That doesn't. That's not a stream, that just makes you accomplices. All the world's elite do drugs? Yes, because they can afford to do drugs. Do I look like a billionaire to you? Your pressure is cool. Yep. Okay. Yeah, unfortunately, I'm not a billionaire, so I will not be doing rugs. You look like a trillionaire. <laughs> so that makes me even more eligible to do drugs. To be cool like the world's elite. I bet that wasn't uh, a good time on Western land. Dalda sniffs kilos, not grams. Nice, Yoshi. That's real nice. I mean, I always, you know, do my best or hardest whenever I'm committed to something. So if I was a committed drug user, I'd probably do kilos. Yes. You know, that filthy European way of measuring things? I still probably would. I should have a segment timer for this one. You can see individual times. The Pothead Federation. That's kind of a nice name. Any oh, that is just nice. I had like five good mini games and the one bad one was chosen. If you put any word behind the word Federation, it just sounds cool. Like it works with like Federation, Confederacy, the yeah, so um what else like like just any of those types of words. Mad Lad Federation. Kinda like it. All out of water. International Federated Daldemet Fan Club. I can dig it.
I'll just do the math in my head. Stop being a bitch. Are you a big Richard Simmons fan? No, I'm not. I merely borrowed his name for a joke on stream a while back ago. I just know that he's like an exercise guru. But no, I'm not a fan, just a knower of him. If like, I prefer to call him Dick Simmons. You can also call him that, yeah. Neat. As a doll, the Maid Incorporated boldly diversifies shareholders welcome the inception of the Mad Lad Federation, a new branch poised to redefine industry norms. I love the lawyer building with these uh, paragraphs except for about like the streams. It's very interesting. Thank you for the one bit. DMHT on the New York Stock Exchange. That's a bit too close to DMT, but I'm sure people will understand the difference. Buy high and sell low. An effective strategy. No, it's not, it's not going to be meth. That's no. Meth is also kind of iffy. DMHT is a badass abbreviation. Uh, yes, so. Sure. Confirm Daldamed does. Dime. Thol. Try. To mean. I don't. More importantly, you don't have any proof that I do. I mean, I mean, this isn't really. This is not a run to be PBable. This is just a benchmark. I'm just placing a time down. Because I'm using Whole Food splits. No, that's not a fire truck. I think that's a raid alarm. Not the raid alarm. The storm raid alarm, or whatever it's called. Yeah, the nuclear alarm. I actually said it right? Nice. I'm glad I'm able to read above a 7th grade reading level. Didn't realize you live in Japan? Of course I do. Japan is a great country. Get to the chopper! I can, I can imagine a future in which Things become more open and liberal. There are actual stores that sell methamphetamines. There are meth producers on the public stock exchange. As drugs become more and more well known and open and stuff, just like how there's weed stores, meth stores. You can just go into a store, buy some meth, and then leave. I can I can definitely imagine that in the future. Thank you for the one bit face tougher. Konichiwa. Right back at you, man. The Nazis did meth in World War Two. I mean why wouldn't you? You think the world is ending. Might as well get high. The fact that there are Nazis just is icing on the cake. Unless the meth contributed to them being Nazis or something, or like... <sighs> or like they would take meth to become stronger or something, like they... Like, 
like a soup like a super serum kind of thing. Their soldiers would take meth and they wonder, huh, why are our Nazi soldiers' teeth falling out? Why do they look homeless? Why is your hair falling out? Why are they sweating so much? I would love to see an image of that, a Nazi doing meth. Bullets don't stop the gibbers. Yeah, probably don't. It just bounces off of them like Superman. There's a ton of footage of Hitler on speed. Is there? Didn't know that. Yeah, I was about to ask if any of you are skilled enough. Can you please AI generate an image of a Nazi doing meth? But both the prompt of Nazi and meth are banned from those services. I didn't know that, I Minikyu. Mean, I just know of Nazi's videos of him giving speeches. Well, if you can't make the image face effort, it's alright. Even conceptually, the idea is pretty funny. Nazi meant. Oh yeah, if Stable Diffusion will work then, sure, go ahead. Nazi meant. Not cement. Always have you noticed how every fucking YouTube vid video has an AI thumbnail these days? Yeah, M and Q, I turned Nazi Met into not cement. It's a plan of words. Because I'm a funny person. I'm a funny streamer, man. Um No, I I, I don't haven't noticed since I don't watch YouTube these days. The only time I go on YouTube is to find songs and then add them to my playlist. This is uh, quite uh, infuriating. This is... What's going on? What's happening? There we go. Yeah, I've not noticed that face stuffer, but... I mean, it makes sense with AI becoming more and more publicly available. And more user-friendly. And people being less creative, they're going to use AI. No, I've completed the entire Married with Children series three times already. I'm actually looking to acquire some more DVDs of old cartoons from Walmart. I want to buy... I'm going to buy the... Um, I'm going to buy uh, the series of Ed and Eddie, Teen Titans, Courage the Cowardly Dog, the Road Trip Trilogy and get those on DVD and watch those. A good show made with children. crash when I typed in Nazi meth. It's just that powerful of, of a prompt, you can't handle it. Maybe try just adding more words or something. Oh, it just didn't work? Okay. Speaking of stable diffusion, have any of you seen those videos compiling Pixar and Disney style movie posters. 
I saw them a while back ago, but I'm just not remembering seeing them. Like, people have made movie posters in the style of Pixar and Disney, but of, like, horrific or super offensive events. Of, like, of course, the Nazis, George Floyd, 9-11, Helen Keller. Um, they just did us a bunch of them. I saw a new Pixar, Pixar poster movie called I'm Gay. <laughs> Yeah, there's a, there's a bunch from us. There's like there's a bunch of YouTube videos recommended to me about that. I was wondering if any of you saw them. And what's funny is that those mo those movie posters seem like to be better movies than what Pix Pixar makes nowadays or Disney. I can't believe Helen Keller flew around the world on her own. She was deaf, dumb, and blind. Inspiring. She truly is. A true role model for women. Uh, there's even a, a Pixar movie poster made of Gigi Allen, and his one of his hands was covered in crap. Because I think he was known for eating feces while performing on stage. G.G. Allen as a Pixar character. I'd probably watch a movie about that. He would fling it in and probably eat it, because he's just that crazy. G.G. Allen, while I didn't know you knew of him. Yeah, I learned about him just like once. I think as like, on, on a YouTube video. I was watching something and there was... Recommended there, something about G.G. Allen. You'd be amazed about what I know about chat, that I don't... That I seem like to not know a lot of things. I do know a few things here and there. But of course I never listen to his music. I just know that he's a person who existed. Who ate feces on stage, most likely. But yeah, I know a few things or two. I know a thing or two, not a few things in two, that's... Two different amounts of things. His music, music is questionable. A man who plays with the feces on live stage during his performances makes questionable music, Rem. Get out of here. What? Are you kidding me? Do you know if you could smoke a bong through cum? I did not know that, no. Or I don't know if you can do that. But his stage performance was influential. I imagine so. He was a genius. Quite possibly so. I mean, I'm just agreeing with you because I, I know nothing about him. So whenever, whenever someone says things... Regarding someone like that about, oh, he was a genius, he was influential. He was underrated. I just take people's opinion on that. Because of how much I don't know about whatever they're talking about. And I don't want to seem like a dickhead. When it, uh, regarding someone's interests, I just say, yeah. He probably was, and sure. Yeah, I just assume... That that's actually my one of my philosophies with streaming. I just, I just assume they're right about whatever interest or hobby they have. And the qualifier they're... Adding to it. So yeah, Gigi Allen was a genius with an influential performance process. Yeah, he definitely was. Sure. SM64 is a good game. You know, sometimes chat's right, sometimes chat's wrong. Ah, uh, I could've hit Mario. Finish. 
Should be 11th turn. Yeah, this is definitely a slow space land. What was her name? The Sniffit Patrol? I can read it was way too fast. I've been late for two hours? Why does it feel like 30 minutes? I've been late for two hours? Wow, okay. Time flies when I'm having fun? Yeah, I guess so. I was actually thrown back a little bit. Throw it back. I'm not throwing it back. But thank you for asking. I don't have time for this. Close out of Nice too. I already have nine points, I don't need to play anymore. And that's not like I'm bragging or anything. Hey chat, what would you think of uh I'm still adding new and good channel point redemptions? What'd you think of a channel point redemption that gives my mic a random a random voice filter? 
for like five minutes or something. long to like three minutes two minutes depends how insane it is it was just a random voice filter. There's like, I think over 50 to choose from, maybe even more. It's just, again, I'm just trying to come up with good, worthwhile channel point redemptions to make sure my chatters have fun. Because that's what I'm all about. Fun. And also happiness. I'm all about fun and happiness. Don't steal my coins. Thank Christ. I should just cut it short and go to the other room with this. Ah, oh, he's too broke. That sucks. Actually, let me give you an example. I'm gonna put a random filter on my voice. Okay, how does this sound? The sound, all right. Sounds scary. Oh, it's called the Sniffer Patrol. Nice. Alright. Yeah, so it would just be various voices like that. Not, ex not ex specifically scary, but just... Oh, no. Okay. Just be, you know, random voice filters. Just thought it'd be a fun idea. Stop. 
Oh my god, DK, you're killing me. You're killing me, man. They always swing down, never across. That kind of works, yeah. A Nazi doing meth. That, yeah. Thank you, face over. That works. I was inspired. I'm glad to have inspired you, man. Or if you, or you can say, influenced. I like how the uh, newest and most viral is a picture of a cosplay. That's real nice. Some anime cosplay. Real family friendly. Imgur. Real family friendly. You really didn't want to do the logo. I had to force it. Or that. Let me show you, chat. The. Ask face over if you can do a Nazi on drugs. what it made. It's pretty good. I'm not an influencer. That was just a one-time joke since people keep calling me that. You gotta force it then. That's what you gotta do. Sometimes things just don't want to work the way you want them to. But if you try some time, you get what you need. Who doesn't start their day with a big old bowl of meth? Cowards. And weaklings do. All part of a balanced, nutritious breakfast. Ah, I should have gone down. Damn it. Actually, I could use another key. Ah, uh, it's opposite. Fuck. I was following the control scheme of skateboard scamper. You roll with B and jump with A. You always switch it up on you. So I can just go back around and uh, buy a key. It's just back to back bad things.
Uh, it's, it's kind of bad. I mean, it doesn't really matter the pace for this one since I'm just placing down a time. In which I will start doing actual runs against. I wonder if I can actually make it to the star. Wow, that is amazing. That is incredible. It just, man, Spaceland. I'll let Ape keep the Space Emerald record. I am not wanting to deal with this. Ready? 
Yeah, it kind of is. And then that stupid cannon that takes away all your coins. Not necessarily a fan. All empty and shit. <laughs> yeah, that too. There's there's no substance anymore. Actually, if my Japanese card is working, I'll just delete all my data and then start fresh there. Make sure I don't unlock that stupid rainbow walk minigame, whatever. Okay, so I'm gonna win this one. So cheating, that's not cheating. You don't have to unlock all the mi- <laughs> MQ, you're, you're timed out for 10 minutes. Sorry. Not only was I dis- not only was I distracted, answering a stupid ass point. No, it's not cheating. I'm out. You did. That's why I did it. And then I got over it. I may have emotions, but I'm an adult. No, it's not cheating. You don't need all the minigames unlocked to play all the boards. And coincidentally, some of the minigames you do unlock later on are annoying, like the rainbow game. So luckily, no, that's not considered cheating. the sniff it force or whatever they're called I think it's actually pronounced sniff it yep it's the sniff it patrol
The only person that can take me out is myself. Nice. That's power right there. <laughs> ah, nice. Very well timed. I'm, I'm glad Pattern recommended that channel point idea, and I, I'm glad I finally added it because that's pretty funny. Last turn doesn't matter. Yeah, in terms of space on performance, this is extremely bad. If I even won, I don't know. Let's try against her two. That's matched. Three. If they get a star, I think I may have still lost. No, I have more coins than Yoshi. No, no I don't. Oh, I did. Okay, nice. Oh, and more stars. Oh, okay, I had more stars. I can't count, apparently. I. Alright. Nice. That's definitely not a PB on Spaceland <laughs> at all. Probably worse by like five minutes. Now it's time for Mystery Land. Finally. Fine to be on top in good position.
This looks so good out of context, actually. I have to post that to Discord. I also, one of these days I have to finally review the Chat Gems channel. Because I've been meaning to do that as well. There's definitely like many years worth of stuff there and plenty of stuff to go through. I should get onto that very soon. Is it me or does the McRib taste different? When I had one, when I had the Big Mac, it did taste different maybe because of the temperature. It was slightly not as warm because I waited a little bit longer. But I've not had the McRib frequently enough to have a consistent taste like index. So uh, maybe it does. Maybe it does. I'll leave you to the side. You're a man with your own taste buds and skills of judgment. I was actually f having the urge to order some takeout. I think initially I was craving a burger, but maybe some Taco Bell. I haven't had that in a while. Had McDonald's breakfast, bussin'. You know it's good when someone describes it as quote unquote bussin'. Which I thought usually was like a, a casual way of saying busting. But I think I was incorrect. Stars right there are nice. In case I end up in like in the in that fourth quadrant and get out there fast with the key. Man, you know, I'm starting to realize I did kind of miss all board runs. It's the length that's good long, you know, enough time to have a bad section of a run and then a very good section of a run. It's way more fun. I'm just not realizing, yeah, I kind of missed this.
What does the McRib taste like? Mmm. Tastes good. Tastes like this ribbed meat. I think it's um I think it's beef. Like I just had one. I just had a McRib, I can't remember it. I believe it's I, I think it's beef. Or pork? Is it pork? It's one of the famous meats. Pork or beef. With pickles, lettuce, and on a sandwich sub bun. McRib is a human baby. Why do you think they call it the McRib? <laughs> yeah, it, it, it tastes more like pork. I mean, I used to be a butcher, so I know my meats. It could be a human baby for, for all we know. I mean, Q, you could be onto something, man. Yeah, Wounded is not liking this right now. I mean, he's not here. But if he was, he would not like it. I'll just talk of Haram. Did you? Yeah. I thought I've. I thought that would have been pointed out before, like in my old stories. Yeah, I used to be a butcher. And before you ask chat, you know that's not a euphemism for me being a male prostitute. My name wasn't like Baldemet the Butcher Mad Lad, where I give, you know, I give the meat. I actually like sliced deadly meats and cheeses. Put them on a scale, package them, give them to the customers. Did you do the whole animal butchery? No, it was already just the, um, the segments, just the chubs. Already came packaged, it was just only sliced, it was my department. Oh, all world torn with no pauses? Yeah, that's how you do it. It's that's how I would do it, that's, that's how I at least do it, because I'm not a bitch. Although, that, yeah, even though I said as a joke, that would be a good prostitute name for me, if I was to become one. Daldemet the Butcher. I deliver the meats. <laughs> Made myself laugh like an idiot. A boar's head is the bomb? Never had a boar's head. I never got that exotic with my meats. I eat the traditional meats. Beef. Pork. Turkey, ham, a little bit of lamb. Had some lamb back in the day. My BFF's name is Butcher. Oh, nice. My BFF's name is Dimes. He's telling me there's cheese in this boar's head. Boar's head is a brand. Is a brand. Borset is a brand, it's the bomb. Oh, okay, never heard of it. Yeah, I'm more of a traditional meats guy. I'm glad out of all the qualities my viewers have, a few selected them, like pattern and face stuffer, and even anball, always provide context, they always provide a link. It's a, f it's a quality a few of you have, but you always provide the context in the background. Authentically crafted, handcrafted according to century-old Salamir traditions, Boar's Head Genoa Salami boasts its robust flavor from an expert blend of pork and pe peppercorns. Nice. You definitely try face suffer, and I appreciate it. I just see it as a mark of enthusiasm. When you send a link or context to the things all of you talk about, I just see it as, oh wow, they're really, they're really enthusiastic about this boar's head meat salami. 
And I love some enthusiasm. All supermarkets along the East Coast have it. Neat. We have to try it one day. I thought you were talking about a literal head of a boar animal. Like, damn, pound, that's extreme. My daily guy always cooks it up. Good on you. For having such a nice daily guy. I felt. I guess I haven't shared stories about my butcher career, but. One of the great things about being a butcher is that when you're slicing meats at a random amount, and they say like a pound, if I slice a random amount and I place it on the scale, and it's exactly a pound, I feel like a god amongst men. I, no, I feel like a god amongst ants. I feel better than everyone who's ever existed when I lay down exactly a pound of meat just by randomly cutting it. I felt like a champion of the universe. Yeah, especially when it's super thin. I hate when customers ordered thin. It was so damn annoying. When they ordered like a pound of like oven roasted turkey, but extremely thin, like lady, get the fuck out of here before I hurt you. <laughs> I'm just kidding, I never said that. But I was thinking it. I lay down a pound of meat every time I sit down. <laughs> Yeah, I hated those customers who ordered super thin cold cuts. Like, Christ, grow the fuck up. You're an adult. You can handle some thickness. Damn wuss. Some of them wanted it so thin that it started falling apart. It becomes like shreds of meat instead of actual layers. It's like, Christ. I want to be able to read the newspaper through it exactly. Finish. It was so damn annoying. And if it wasn't it wasn't even old ladies who ordered it, because at that point it's understandable. But grown adult men even ordered super thinly shredded, fine shredded meat. Like, where are your testicles, dude? Fuck. What's up, Stick Sand? Long time no see, man. Hope you're having a great day. Yeah. Handsome gentleman. <laughs> Thank you. Hey, uh, let me get two pounds of that pastrami shaved, please. Bitch, you're lucky I don't put your head to the shaver. Okay, I'm not giving you two pounds. Again, I wouldn't say that, I would just think it in my head. My arm would also hurt because I would have to push it down on the on the meat backer that like pushes the meat down. My my arm would sore because I'm trying to push it down to get it through the thin, like one atom thick slice area. I'm surprised I haven't like accidentally or intentionally shared stories about my butcher career. I liked it. I liked being a butcher, Phil. Good. Ready? Especially because they run the heater back there so the windows don't fog. What are you talking about? The what? Running the heater so the windows don't fog. What is this shaved meat slander? I'm slandering people who order shaved meat to the point where it's only atoms thick. Like they order a large amount of only shaved meat that's like a molecule in thickness. I hate people who do that. Oh yeah, the display windows, yeah. We had a problem with the windows always fogging up. And then we had a little mini squeegee to uh, take off the water and the condensation. Yeah, it's just a problem. Ours even had like a leak problem at the bottom of it. 
there was water leaking. It was old. The, the, the equipment we had, it was old. Damn lady, you got more meat down there than our piece. <laughs> okay, man. Men handling meat all day? Gonna give girls the ick. I mean, that was my job, damn it. In the game. When you're a butcher, that's what you do. Explains why men are butchers and not women, because only men... Know how to handle some meat. It's a bunch of sausage havers slicing sausage. Also, again, it wasn't only meat, it also sliced cheeses. Which honestly was better because the cheese residue that leaves behind is easy to clean off. There's, there's no liquids to manage or anything, it's just a solid matter of cheese. Can you say we have the meats? I mean, I just did. <laughs> there you go. Arby's. We have the meats. I, j I just did it, yeah. I knew he meant it in the Arby's voice, so I did it ahead of time. Yeah. Always one step ahead. I do like Arby's curly fries, those are really good over there. And of course the roast beef sandwiches, yeah. Like the little sliders of roast beef sandwiches. I think so far this mystery line is going pretty well. But you have two stars and it seems to be moving pretty fast. Despite that one honeycomb havoc. Buckets on the first try, baby, man. Why wasn't I a bas basketball player? Gets, gets world record without even trying. I do my best, man. The The chances of this run P being, I say, are very sl uh, slim. World record, practically impossible. I don't have any fantasies. I'm getting world record right now, but maybe a PB if this clears up just a little bit.
Okay. Well. Okay, I'm looking at something inappropriate, I gotta stop. Rem, what is that icon you keep typing? It's like a symbol. What is that? I bet it's boobs, it wasn't boobs. the Among Us thing, okay. That I mean, looks very interesting. Yeah, I know. Looks a bit strange, but nice. What kind of person will look at boobs on stream? That seems a bit too strange. Your face in one of the in one of Gert's pics. Yeah, it's like one of his AI images. You have humongous fingers. You can't even see my fingers. Like I've shown them once on stream, but they're more long than humongous. But thanks. You look a darker Bin Laden in that picture. Oh, in the picture, yeah, the on the eight ball. Also, why didn't it toggle invisibility? Oh, it changed, damn it. I don't know why settings keep changing on all my software. What the hell? There we go. Okay, because yeah, it should not show the new image automatically. It needs to hide it first. So no one submits like a pic image of like giant boobs or something. is not so good on the fingers. More times than not, an AI will give you like six fingers or four fingers. Neat. 
You motherfucker eight ball scum shovel tape scratch forth the grass Tyson chicken scoff cow. Jerry Rice would put you in a coffin. Gerth, why did you log into Rem's account? I would have fixed the fingers, but I didn't want to mess with Gert's art too much. That's alright. Looks nice, regardless. Thank you for the one bit girth. I don't know why you're on Rem's account, but thanks, man. Wasn't directed to you, that was for the scumbag Neil deGrasse Tyson. Oh. Because your message started off with you, so. I imagine that was towards me. Yeah, I still don't get this whole Neil deGrasse Tyson routine you're doing, but okay. I'm assuming your hatred is, is validated. What was the weirdest thing that ever happened to you that you can remember when you were a butcher? I think nothing too weird. Most of it was just annoyances for people ordering obscene amounts of meat very thin. If anything weird happened, it was because it was a butcher. It was not butcher related. I definitely didn't write down any stories. I keep forgetting. A woman wanted Dalda to pound her roast beef. Or beef roast. No, a lady didn't ask me to do that. I don't think anything that weird actually happened, just annoying customers. That's every day for Dalda. It's actually not. Yeah, nothing, uh, nothing that weird. I think, like, a fight almost broke out between two disagreeing gentlemen. That was it. Luckily, the life of a butcher is a pretty normal one. Clock in, give people the meat, and then go home. So you send your finger through a bandsaw. <laughs> I mean, we don't have bandsaws like in the deli. They're they're small slicers. But luckily, I did not send my finger through one. An employee at the time actually did do and cut her finger just a little bit. But luckily, it wasn't um, like a removal of the finger. Just like on Pornhub? What? What kind of pornography are you watching? 
How do you saw the bones? I'm assuming very carefully. No, her f no, sh sh she cut her finger on the saw, but it wasn't so much that she removed the, her digit. It was just a, a cut. Zelda, let's hear your best Jamaican accent. First of all, Blanco, please is a word you can use as well. It's a word. It's a word free of charge you can use. Jamaican, I don't know. I'm not. So, I'm not so good with accents and impressions. What's good, Mon? There you go. I remember one time during the um, Halloween stream that I had in November, Wounded said I look like um, Jamaican Mario because I was doing a cosplay of Groucho Marx. And he said, yeah, I look like Jamaican Mario. I thought about doing an accent there, but then again, I can't do accents. My voice is locked to this one register, man. I can't do like high-pitched girly stuff or just other tones and stuff, it's just this. Sorry. Clock in, take the meat clock out. Yep. Are you saying because you made lunch slices you were a butcher? Usually the butcher takes a whole slaughtered animal and turns it into cuts of meat. Well, I did butcher meat, just not the full process of. It was already prepared, like packaged chubs. I just took the chubs and sliced into slices. So I still technically butchered meat, which makes me a butcher. What did you do outside of running the slicer? I would clean the slicer. Disassemble it. Clean it off of meat scraps and juices and then put it back together again. And then I would do the same thing on the cheese slicer. Sounds like a deli tech. I guess that was my other job, technically. Would it be funny if you came out of that job a vegan? Would be kind of funny, but no. Dollar to women. Hey, I'm a butcher. Let me put my piece of meat in between your slices. I've never said that to a woman before, but possible. The only time I became even close to a vegan when I was watching a YouTube summary of a movie about like these people who get lost on a bus trip and end up on, end up on a farm that's ran by these people who wear animal masks and these people in animal masks treat these people like cows and pigs they impregnate them, milk them, and then eat them and I think the whole thing was supposed to be like a a point about the cruelty of the animal and meat industry and in, in one of the scenes, the ending scene, it zooms in on a on one of the women who were captured, stuffed and roasted like a pig, and her body's just on a silver platter, on a table around a bunch of people ready to be eaten. And I, I was so disgusted by that movie, I couldn't eat meat for at least a couple hours. But then I got over it and then ordered a burger. But at least for those couple hours, I was mentally a vegan. all the meats. Okay. I forget the name of the of the movie, but I, I didn't watch the actual movie. It was just those YouTube channels that make summaries about the movies. They just explain the, the entire movie in 20 minutes. Yeah, that's the closest time ever I became came close to being a vegan. No, it wasn't a bug's life. It wasn't ants, no. 
There's literally no bugs in the movie. Getting confused all the time too, it's okay. No, that's right, I don't have him confused. It was a different It wasn't Ant-Man now. Say ants. What was the point of that? Reminded me of a bug's life. Are you sure? Yeah, there were, there were no bugs or insects anywhere in the movie. It was about large scale animals like pigs and cows and human. And humans were being eaten. There's also this one scene where a human woman was inseminated and had a baby. And then one of the masked people took the baby and then like, <laughs> like smacked it on the ground. It wasn't homeward bound, no. I just remember that being like a very traumatic scene. All those into some weird stuff is what I'm getting from this. No, I'm not into weird stuff. I'm just describing scenes from a very horrific movie that temporarily altered my uh, perception on things. It wasn't tuned porn. I don't watch tuned porn. Unless you're saying that you yourself faced up or watch toon porn. I am not a consumer of that. saw that thumbnail of the clip where I agree with my past self accidentally. That was a very funny clip.
I don't know where this even end thing like started coming from, but nice. Always kind of reminded me of a young flick. Is that the ant, like the main ant character? I've never seen ants, so I'm not sure how that how I relate to him, but I'm assuming you're being sincere with that comment. Because I assume all, all, I assume all comments are sincere. Oh yeah, Bugs Life. That's what I meant. I'm assuming you're being... You, you meant that naturally. Or genuinely. I've never seen either Ants or Bugs Life. I've played the Bugs Life game on Game Boy. When have I ever not been genuine? Yeah, I know. All of you are very genuine and sincere. And th that's just how I interpret all chat messages. It's safer, safer to assume all chat messages are sincere and genuine, so I don't <clears throat> come off as some unfeeling douchebag. Ants is... I'm not gonna say that last word. Face up for you know the language is not allowed here, both because of the culture of the chat and because of your age. Please be like a grown adult. So thanks for cropping that image. I'm not sure if the dimensions of the SBR bot are noted, but if you want the image to take up the full thing, the dimensions of the of the thing should be on there. No, it should be on the on the redemption. It should be listed the dimensions of it. Let me check. How did DK get so many coins? I don't know, I don't have it listed because it's it's a command, not a channel point thing. Never mind. Yeah, if you if any wanna know that or jot this down so your image takes up the the full thing. A tag, yeah. I think I think the A tag command does work. If any of you want to know the dimensions of the bot, so your image takes up the full thing, it's a width of 344 and a height of 431. Sometimes images are submitted, but there's still black borders. Yeah, I need to make a command or something about that. I don't think it's a ratio. I tried getting a 19 by 6 ratio, but it would have been too tall and too thin. Okay, okay, yeah. I love this control stick so much. And yeah, it's not any standard ratio, I couldn't get it that way.
Yeah, now it's onto Horrorland. Actually, I think the dimensions may be included 